Hello everyone. I welcome you all to ATM Creations. I'm back after a long break. So, I thought I'll make a dot mandala on a 20 inch NTF base and uh, show you the process right from the beginning. But uh, here I have the base which is already painted in black. So, what I'm going to do is right from finding the center, drawing the circles, creating the grids, I thought I'll show the entire process to you. Let's get started. And to find the center, the first thing that I do is I take the MDF base. Though I know it is 20 inches, I'm still going to go ahead and measure. It's exactly 20 inches. So obviously the radius is half of it. So I'm going to measure the compass for the radius. So I'm measuring the compass for the radius part. So 10 inches is this now. So to figure out the center, this is what I do. I keep the pencil edge to the edge of the MDF board and fairly move the compass around and then make little adjustments. So here is the center. Let me mark it. Now I'm going to draw some circles. I generally don't measure the circles. I only draw random circles. Let me draw a few. And I'm going to draw seven more circles now of the same size probably. Now I'm going to take another compass, which is a little big, here it is, and draw some more circles. Now I'm going to draw a line which divides all these circles into half. So here is a center dot and there is a line here. So I will keep the protractor exactly in sync with that dot and the line. And now I'm going to mark the angles at um, every 30 degree. So 30, 60, 90, 120, 150. And this is 210, 240, 270. This is 300 and this is 330. So 0 and 180 falls here. Now I'm going to connect the dots that I made. So I'll always connect the... 90 degree part first so that according to me chances of making mistake is less than I don't use white charcoal pencils to draw circles or draw lines because according to me it gets difficult to erase the lines after that so I use a normal pencil so in this case um, I don't even take any effort to erase it after I finish dot painting I just leave it as it is. There are many who ask me how do you erase the lines and I always tell them I don't erase the lines at all. So in this dot model I am going to use only metallic and pearl colors. I will start dotting with gold in the center. Now I will keep tiny dots around this main dot. Now I will keep some dots in light green. Now I'll keep tiny dots in light green. Now I'll keep some dark green dots. Now I'll keep some tiny dots. Now I'll keep some light violet dots. Now I'll keep tiny dots in light violet. Now I'll keep dark violet dots. Now I'll keep tiny dots in dark violet. Now I'll keep some dots in light pink. Now I'll keep tiny dots in light pink. Now 
Now I'll keep some pink dots. Now I'll keep some tiny dots. Now I'll keep some golden dots. Now I'll keep tiny dots in gold. Now I'll keep some golden dots. For the first time I'm trying out the pattern. I don't know how it is going to work. Let me try anyway. I'm going to keep some light green dots here. There are three plain tools. So this is the smallest one. This is medium and this is big. Now I'm going to dot in light green using the medium one. Now dark green dots. Now I'll keep light violet dots. Now I'll keep dark violet dots. Now I'll keep light pink dots. Now I'll keep some pink dots. Now I'll work the dots in light green. Now I'll work the dots second layer of light green. Now I'll work the dots all the three layers in dark green. Now I'll work the dots in light violet. Now I'll work the dots in dark violet. Now I'll work the dots using light pink. I'll work the dots in pink now. I'll keep some golden dots now. Now I'll work the dots in gold.
Now I'll keep straight swipes in gold. I'll keep a plumpy dot then make it to a swipe later. Now I'll make these dots into swipes. Now I'll keep some light violet dots. Now I'll keep dark violet dots. Now I'll keep some light pink dots. Now I'll keep pink dots. Now light green dots. Now dark green dots. Now I'll work the dots in light violet. I'll work the dots in dark violet now. Now I'll work the dots with light pink. Now I'll work the dots with pink. Now I'll work the dots with light green. Now I'll work the dots with dark green. Now I'm going to work the dots third layer. Now I'll work the dots third layer of light violet. Now third layer of dark violet. Now third layer of light pink. Now third layer of pink. Now third layer of light green. I'll keep some golden dots now. Now I'll work the dots in gold. I'm going to place some mirrors, so I'll place Favicol first. I'll place these circular mirrors now. After placing the mirrors, I'm giving a gentle press so that the mirrors get stuck to the board firmly. Now I'll keep golden dots around these mirrors. Now I'll keep straight swipes and light pink. Now I'll keep straight swipes in pink.
Now I'll keep straight swipes in light green. Now I'll keep straight swipes in dark green. Now I'll keep straight swipes in light violet. Now I'll keep straight swipes in dark violet. Now I'll keep straight swipes in gold. I'm sure this metallic dot mandala came out really well. Thank you for watching this video.